Every Friday, we show you the positive stories in eastern Idaho with people and places we all appreciate. We call it the bright side, and tonight we start with another big donation to the Boys and Girls Club. On Wednesday, the Boys and Girls Club of Southeast Idaho received a big donation, and yesterday they received another one. Representatives from Farm Bureau Insurance were on hand to present the $10,000 donation to the club. These donations will help the Boys and Girls Club pay for supplies and staff as they get ready to expand into Indian Hills Elementary next fall. The company as a whole has been making a concentrated effort to give back more into the community, and this is such a worthwhile uh, cause for us to be a part of in the early stages to help it get off the ground that the employees uh, our agents and everybody in the organization is just thrilled and thinks it's very cool to be part of uh, this donation. A group of volunteers helped to beautify a public park this week. A group from Idaho Central Credit Union adopted Cotant Park in Chubbuck and helped paint some score sheds. If your group wants to adopt a park and help out, you can visit the city of Chubbuck's website for information. Last week, the Bingham County Sheriff's Office held the first annual Santa's Helpers Golf Tournament. They said it was a great turnout. All the proceeds go to the Santa's Helpers program, which gives kids Christmas to kids in need. The Sheriff's Office will continue to hold more fundraisers throughout the rest of the year. United Way of Southeast Idaho took part in a celebration for Farm Bureau. During the event, Farm Bureau received the Heart of the Community Award. The company raised more than $27,000 for United Way's 2022-2023 campaign. If you have an idea for The Bright Side, you can send us an email to newsroom at kpvi.com. We're interested in your positive stories about the people and places of eastern Idaho.